Hi there. In this SendCart video, I'm going to uh, address the issue of product quantity showing up on your listings. Now, you have listings that may or may not need product quantity. For example, I have a service and I've put it in as a thousand units to begin with as a product quantity. But I really don't want to show this product quantity because there's an unlimited quantity and there may be a time when you need to do that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into my stores configuration right here, my uh, into my admin. And under configuration, there is a listing called product listing. Now, under product listing, it says display product quantity. Now, conventional wisdom would have that if you set that to zero, that you're not going to be displaying the quantity. And that's actually been answered on the forums as a method of hiding the quantity. But there's actually a little bit more to it. So if we go back here, that's set to zero. You can see that it's set to zero. And I can go ahead and refresh, and I see that I have 987 units still left in stock. So what I've found is you need to go over to uh, Catalog, Product Types, and also on Product Types, it's Product General, and uh, we'll edit that. Let's go ahead and edit Product General. So you go to Quantity and Stock, and you can see the value here is set to 1 by default. So we're going to set that to 0, which is false. We're going to update, and that's all there really is to it. And we go back over here and we refresh, and you'll notice that I've got the 987 in stock here. And then when I refresh, that gets rid of that. Now that's how you can handle that on a global basis. Uh, you may, I, I may have to look into how you would do it on one versus the other, but I basically have a global situation where either I want to display it or I don't. So anyway, that's uh, that's that. That's how you change the uh, how you delete or remove the available quantity from your listing. And uh, if you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the section down below. If you need any help with your cart, please visit me. I'll have an address to my uh, website down below. And I do hourly custom programming, as you can see from this listing. Uh, I also do installs, module installs, and things of that nature. Once again, thanks for watching. I hope this has helped you. Uh, we'll see you in another video.